Hi guys, this is Mina and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're going to learn how to auto-generate schemas and insert statements with data within SQL Server Management Studio. Have you ever encountered a scenario where during data migration or preparing metadata, you are required to generate schema and also insert scripts for that table just for testing purpose? Or have you ever had a need to auto-generate insert statement with data in it from one table just for backup purposes? Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can export schema or insert statement that has data in it or both for both inserting into another table or simply as a backup. Let's move on to our SQL Server Management Studio and try this out. So here in my SQL Server Management Studio, I'll go to databases and I have a table in essential database. So I'll go to tables and I want to work with product table because I know that it has substantial amount of data in there. So when I open this table, it has, it has three columns. And so traditionally, if you want to script out this table schema, you would right click on it and script table as create to another window to get the create table statement. And here it is. Also, if you want to script out the insert statement for this table, you would right click, go to script table as. So you have several options here. You can script out a drop table syntax and also select can give you a select statement for you to run um, insert so this is what i want to show you right now so i'm going to copy the script for inserting records into a clipboard and then i can paste it here so if you have this query you can have you can sit down and populate the records in here and execute the insert statement but today, I'm going to show you how you can do all of this in one step. And the result of the table is going to be the same. Um, however, the result for the, the insert into script is going to have data in there. You're going to actually see data in these columns here. So that you can save it for backup. You can run anytime. Or you can execute it into another table for testing purpose all right so to do that you would have to come to the database right click on it and go to tax go to generate script on this page this is an introduction page you can choose to not show this page again but i'll go to next and you can also choose to script out the entire essential database and every object in it including views installed procedures but today i'm just going to script out one table so i'll select this select specific database object and click on the plus sign to select the product table i'll move on to next and under the advanced tab i'm looking for the type of data to script i can choose to script only the schema which will give me the create table syntax or I can choose to script out the insert statement with data or I can choose to do both. Today I'm going to script out both of them and click on OK. I can save to clipboard so I can paste it by myself or I can open a new query window and go on to next. Next in this page is validating my request and preparing it for me. So even before I click on finish my script has been generated and here is it this top part is my create table syntax and this bottom part is my insert into statement and as you can see insert into you can this script still runs but if it matters to you you can put insert into and this is also valid so insert into the table the columns in bracket values and these are the values in that table okay so product 
one these are the values if you want to see i can just select these records for you to see new grand and execute this so as you can see mountain handlebar hmb9 if i come here yeah exactly the same records within that table for your reference so this i can save to be later executed so you can have this as a backup on my local file or if i'm choosing this for testing purpose i can execute this command into another database and table so for instance i want to execute this command in my demo database so i can change this to demo database and also you make sure that i am set to demo database here just i'm just gonna have to review this script a little bit the create table syntax looks good the insert script also looks good so i can execute this command and it has been created in my demo database so if i come to my demo database go to tables as you can see i have product table created here so if i select to new query window and execute this is my product table here guys this is so much fun and i hope you find this video really really useful for you in in your work or in your studies thank you so much for staying here with me on this video and i hope you guys explore the rest of the videos on my channel and see you in my next one bye bye